All right, folks, we are back. And this this is this month's um, comics and physical media. We want to show you we've got a lot to go over. So this might be a little bit longer than we're used to. And the reason why, of course, is because we have Record Store Day, guys. So, And then we've also picked up some records from our good friend, Haley Anderson. So we ended up getting Soul Dusk, Antithesis. And we got Lunar Falls. But then, these are from uh, Napalm. That we picked up. And then we got from uh, Record Store Day, we got Screaming Trees. Get in there on that. Let's just see what it says. So this is a, an old demo tape put onto record. But you know, I want to enjoy that. The most important one we could have got, though, was this one. Olympus Awaits, and this is from Malfunction. Of course, it's being Andrew Wood, had to have it. Um, this is the predecessor, of course, to Lo Mother Love Bone, which, of course, was for before Pearl Jam, so had to have it. This, of course, um, was also led into Temple of a Dog because of what happened. We also picked up Team Sleep. Which, of course, is the front man from Deftones, Chino Marino. You got Zach Hill, Todd Wilkinson, Crooked One, Rob. I mean, as you can see, even Mike Patton is on here. Come on, guys. If you don't know who Mac Mike Patton is, then you definitely were not born in the 90s, or at least the 80s. Come on. Uh, we picked up, we got Lincoln Park's Paper Cuts. This is their uh, singles collection, pretty much their greatest hits, right? As you can see, all the good ones that's on there. There's some unre unreleased stuff. But there's a lot, right? So yeah, some of this new stuff has been playing on the radio lately, like Friendly Fire uh, and stuff like that. So glad, so glad they came out with the greatest hits one. And then... One of Nate's favorite albums of all time, I've got to have it, was Alice in Chains, Jar of Flies, folks, because that was a phenomenal time um, for us. When these albums came out in the 90s, I was having a blast. So glad to have this one. This is the Black Ed Final edition of it. This is just a regular. This will be my listener copy. Um, Rotten Apple. Nutshell. I Stay Away. No Excuses. Don't Follow. I mean, it's an EP, right, folks? So think about that. That means it's only seven songs. You know, they used to have it combined with Sap as well. So when you got all of it um, back then... You got both albums, so it was great. All right, we gotta set these aside because we got to show you this one. This is the Jar of Flies limited edition box set. Um, as you can see, it's actually got. And we're gonna open it. You can see on here. Like little imprints of flies. I okay. mm. a jar of flies, literally. <laughs> that is just come on, that's great. Okay. You've got the uh, lenticular in there. And then on the side is actually where they have the book and the vinyl. So, I was glad to get this set. It is extremely, extremely sold out. And so, you're not going to find it. So, this goes with my uh, dirt one. So, now I just need to go back and find face facelifts one, which... That will be expensive because it's aftermarket. All right, now we did get some uh, actual media in the mail too. So we've got 
uh, The Departed. We got Patrick. So you got, this is uh, Indicator, my first Indicator film, actually. So I had to pick this up. And then, of course, it's The Departed. Come on, folks. And it's a steel book, so I had to have it. Okay, from Second Sight, we've got a, a plethora of things that came in. Uh, we got Borderlands, the Blu-ray set, and then Possessor, the 4K. And so what they did is they did a digipack for Possessor, and then they did the regular blue Blu-ray for that one. And then we got another Second Sight. We got Green Room, Anton Yelchin. Again, it says it's a 4K. They're doing the um, Digibook version. From Media Psychos, we got in Batman Begins from Mantelab. So we got number 471 out of 600. This is the one click edition. That's about all I buy. I buy the one clicks. Um, so glad to have the set though. 4K HDR. Now, granted, I also have the Fanatic set and I also have the Blue Fan set. So I got a couple, right? Right. And then, last but not least, from media this month, we also got Macross Zero. The Blu-ray box set. Um, this is the new remastered edition. And this does have subtitles. In English. So, and then the limited edition came with the uh, card set as well. So, we will do a review on this one. Don't worry. Alright. Now, let's get on with comics for this month, folks. So, we've got a ton of stuff. But recently, um, as of last weekend, we just picked up these two. Scotty, Scott Lewis, we got Lady Death, um, Heartbreaker Premium, and then the Sketch Variant Edition of Reloaded 2, Scott Lewis. So I had to pick these up. You guys know me, I'm a huge chaos guy. So when I saw them, I had to snag them up. All right, while I was a Titan, they also had the Joe Jasko Savage Sword of Conan. I had to pick it up. I'm picking this up solely for the cover. Uh, I know Titan is going to has been doing a great run with it, but it's Joe Jasko, and I gotta support my guys. Okay, from Clan McDonald, we picked up some of these, some slabbies. Yes, slabbies. Okay, so we've got a uh, 9.8 signed by Brian Polito, and then a nine, another 9.8 uh, signed by Mike DeBalfos. Both are CBCS. To me, it doesn't bother me. As you can see here, signed this year by DeBalfo, and then this one was signed last December. So literally for the December issue. So that's kind of cool. Um, and then we picked up the Clan McDonald. And thank you, Colin, for an amazing sale on this one. I appreciate you. We've got, this is the Clan McDonald exclusive trade version. Um, one four, 142 out of 150. So, had to have this one. And you get a whole bunch of stuff with it. That, which is awesome. I like goodies. All right, more stuff that we got. So from our good friend and artist Colette Turner, we got uh, in lingerie. We've got the metallic edition, and then we've got the regular edition, and then they're both remarked as you can see here, and then here, and most importantly though, little CTs. These are artist proof editions. So. So glad to have these in the set. So, and she does a Patreon, so check it out. Oh, and by the way, 
She sent me the sketches. The prelims. Yay! I like preliminaries. Okay. Um we got a bunch today. We got a ton and ton. So we got the Justin Hunt. This is the B cover that I needed to finish up the set. Um, let's see, that one is, yeah, here we go. The Risque Cyber Edition. I had the Cyber Savage Edition. Now the Risque. Yep. We also got the Dawn Secrets number one. This is a Necro Sketch C limited to 50. So, yeah, had to snag this one. Had to snag this one. Okay, and got lucky. Uh, we got Hellwitch Commission D limited to 65. So, now I just need A. And then I'll be done with that set. And then we got the naughty Lady Satanus Dawn set. So, so glad to have these in the set. I have the regular version, and it's a slab. So, I might have to go get another regular one. Okay, so Coffin had a retro goodness sale, which I had to be part of, of course, because of the old chaos days. Um, as you can see, we got the Peter Vale, we've got Michael David Beck, and then of course the Ivan Reese. These are old school homages to the originals um, that came out, like Tribulation, you know, Judgment, or Rapture, I think. Um, and then I was like, okay, gotta have this because I've got the Chromium edition, right? And so I'm gonna do some line by side by side pictures of those uh, later. Not today, in this video, but in another day. So yeah, we had to grab those. And then, had to grab one of my favorites. This is Ivan Reese from Alive. Alive was one of my favorite stories because it was completely different. Right, as you can see, 91 to 2011. The old school coffin comics. Print. Like I said, I don't buy a whole lot of prints. You guys know that. But I had to have that one. Because of what it was. Okay, so I went to the Dallas Comics Show. Um, and found a, reach, a seller there. And he's like, I got a... He had a ton. Like a ton and ton of goodies. Like this kind of goodie stuff. Chastity. Crazy Town 2, the variant, the Monty Moore edition. And then we got a Scott Lewis, Lady Death, Bad Kitty. We got Bedlam, number one, the regular edition. We got She, Kishi. This is actually the collected edition. So. And it's got a Mike Silvestri cover. Um, he had Wolverine She. This is part of the crossover they had. This is the Marvel Comics side of it. Of course, I saw a cave woman, so you know how that had to come home. Especially when it's Bud Root, you know. Had to have this one. This is Cave Woman. Entertainment. This is Extinction Cave Woman Extinction Limited to seven fifty. Um, Razor, actually number two from James o, James O Bar cover. This is uh, Heart Sews, and then number three from Jim Balin. So I had to, had to snag it. They were like five bucks. Yeah, five bucks each that's a good deal it's a great deal okay um from unknown comics this month we got the anna joe um lilo and stitch number two had to have these for the kids 
Um, and I've actually got another set with Anna right now to get remarked because these are for the kids and I'm going to have my set for me. All right. And look at that cute. Look at that little stitch. Oh. Okay. I won a uh, raffle with the angry artist. William Russell. This is uh, Pooh Ends, which is an homage to Halloween Ends. This is the AP number five, WR five, um, by by William. So thank you, brother. From Comic Connection, my boy Jason Witten got the Art of Sun Kamenaki. Um, this is volume two. I need to get volume one. So if anybody has volume one. That they want to do get rid of let Nate know please okay um, from an FOC with clan we picked up Archie and friends hot rod racing this of course is our good friends Steven and Lily Butler so I had to pick this one up gotta support your friends folks um, ended up getting the ex my extra book being gargoyles but this is a marat michaels cover so definitely going to be keeping this one uh we got the fog number two number two and then number two these are all the the variant covers so uh, i get the primaries through uh pastime but i get my variants through clan because pastime doesn't always get those ones but they try, they do their best. That's all you can ask for. All right, on to some Kickstarters. So we got in our summer specials. So we got the uh, Merc Summer Monster Summer Special, Sora, and then the whoop, whoop, um, Sora uh, two two pack set. Um, like I said, it's from Merc. So finally got this one in. All right. Okay, and then uh, from Prismatic, right? We got in the Anna Joe. We've got the black and white, and then we got the hollow foil, and this is limited nine out of ten and thirty-five out of forty. And then we got. The goodie bag and then we got limited to 20 the leather michael d pascal is final cover final published cover so i had to grab this one okay all right we got a bunch of these uh we got our psycho cell number five that came in so first up, we got the Ruth Lucas, the Amy Good, the Ivy Cosplay, the William Russell, Sean Forney. Check out that interview me and Sean did. We had a good time. Uh, the Ezekiel Dominguez. Okay. Back here, stand up there. Then we got the Anna Joe, the Ken Hunt cover as well. Okay, so yeah, we got all of them psycho cells. All right, from our good friend Carissa Grant, we also got in Redemption. Number nine, this is uh, book two, chapter two. Book two started with chapter eight, so we're on to the next storyline. Okay, we're almost there, folks. Almost there. So, from our good friend Murphy, um, with our new labels that she's got, Damsel, preview edition. We got this one. 
This is from Dreamhouse Publishing. So they just did their Kickstarter as well. So you got this preview before the Kickstarter kicked off. Okay, then we got a bunch of books from Planet McDonald. Uh, yes, a lot. And as you see what they are, right? Thundercats, number one. These are all number one. Stand up there. Okay. You see Perillo, you know, Moss, and then Nakayama. And then we got the foil, the J. Lee, regular, the J. Lee sketch, right? Yep, yeah, had to have that one. And then the foil. And then you get the action figure. And so only with number one do you get the blank. So, and I like how they did it. They put like an extra sheet over it to protect the blank. Okay. Then we got number two, Nakayama. Perio. Moss, you got the regular, and then you got the sketch, okay, then you got that one, and then the action figure. So, yeah, I'm enjoying these, it's been a fun run. Um, so, I will tell you that these boys are busy at Clan and Dynamite with all these packages that they're doing. Um, so, yeah, that is it for this month. Hope you guys take it easy and have a good one. And I'll see you in the next one. All right, all right, all right. Swarm. So